The United States Military Academy at West Point is America's oldest and most respected leadership institution. Since 1802, West Point has given the country some of its greatest generals and presidents. For 173 years, it barred women. In 1976, women were admitted and a truly representative generation of leaders for our Army and our nation was born. Porcelain on Steel by West Point graduate Donna McAleer is the award-winning account of 14 women graduates who took an oath to defend and serve their country with honor. The women in Porcelain on Steel and the women of West Point's long gray line are real women, real leaders, not fabricated by the media. Inspirational stories of women breaking barriers are testament to their strength, courage, and perseverance. These women overcome challenges, like losing a limb in battle, fighting life-threatening cancer, and dealing with the death of a spouse. They are rich, they are poor, they are black, they're white, they're Hispanic, they're straight, they're lesbian. They represent our American fabric. They forge successful careers in military and civilian life, giving back to their country and communities. These are stories of mothers, daughters, and wives, stories of educators and athletes, of doctors and lawyers and officers who all started as soldiers. Their stories and more are told in Porcelain on Steel, women of West Point's long gray line. Real women, real leaders, real life.